want to show you how to wrap a standard CD jewel case. And this is the standard thickness CD jewel case. This is a standard CD width roll. This is a roll that we keep in stock. So what we're going to do is we're going to put this on our over wrapper on the Zopax. And we're going to kind of line it up so that it's roughly centered. Then I'm going to pull it forward. Now you can see that my fingers are underneath the plastic. You want to take just a moment, pull your fingers outside. So now my fingers are outside. And then use your index fingers and put those on the end and get it to where you can kind of hold, put a little pressure with your index fingers and you can kind of adjust with your other fingers. So we're going to pull forward and then we're going to have a little bit of overlap here, enough about the depth of the box. We're going to push over and then we're going to pull our fingers back. Let me do that again. We're going to push it over and pull my fingers back and out of the way. Sometimes it'll lay flat, sometimes it won't lay exactly flat and that's okay. Now as I pull it across the wire, I'm not in a big hurry. I can stand here and make some adjustments. I want you to notice how you're holding this. So we've talked about having your fingers outside the plastic, but you also want to make sure this end that's toward you is down. So with that end down, let me just adjust this one more time. I'm going to tap that corner of the box and just roll up. This edge here, when I tap here, it automatically brings it across the wire and cuts it. So don't focus on the wire, just bring it over, focus on this edge, with this side down, we're tap and roll up. So I've got a nice clean first seal. To do the sides, you want to push in with your index fingers, and when I do that, it kind of presses these off to the side. So I'm going to press in, and then I'm going to roll them back and out of the way. With those back and out of the way, I'm going to use this front edge to tap against the heat. So we're pushing it away, we're rolling my fingers out of the way, and I'm going to use that front edge, and sometimes you can kind of roll up and then down. Just press it against the heat, and then tap, and then roll. The reason I had done that was because it was flaring out a little bit, and that just lines it up, it lays flat. Let's do that again. So we're going to push our fingers in, roll our fingers back and away, out of the way. I'm going to tap and roll, and then tap and roll. And that's sealed this edge, and now we have a nice mitered edge. Nice clean wrap.